Hems Oil Biogas is a food waste anaerobic digestion facility and we can process up to 90,000 tonnes of food waste a year. The end product is biogas. We bring to the table a complete solution for these anaerobic digestion systems. We complete the process design, supply the equipment, and do the commissioning and startup activities for the facilities, and then ultimately hand it over to our clients for them to do long-term operations. The food waste we bring in is a mixture of packaged food waste and liquid waste. Inside our reception building, we accept the packaged waste. Trucks tip the waste into the pit. From the pit, we have a hydraulic grapple, so we pick it up and shred it before it then feeds into our depackaging machine. It separates the packaging from the organic, and that's where we add the liquid waste, forms a slurry that then gets pumped outside to the first stage of the digestion process. The primary tanks is our buffer and hydrolysis tank. It's the first stage of digestion, and the molecules are basically breaking down and producing VFAs, which are volatile fatty acids. When it leaves the hydrolysis tank, we then pasteurise it in batches. The pasteurisation process is there for the pathogen kill. The pasteurised slurry is pumped over to the anaerobic digesters. They have two one million gallon digesters on site. They are mixed with a sequential gas mixing system. This takes biogas off the headspace of the digester, it compresses it and puts it out through a manifold across the bottom of the digester. It's a very low energy solution for mixing and it's very effective at very high solids concentrations. The majority of the biomethane is produced within the digesters and from the digesters we have a gas holder. The gas that we produce is used one of two ways. We can either send it through CHP units, which are combined heat and power units, gives us electricity to feed back into the grid, but it also enables us to self-power our own site. Any excess we do a further cleanup and we inject that back into the national gas grid. A byproduct of the process is a nutrient-rich liquid fertiliser which is spread locally on farms. Everybody's always talking about renewable energy. Countries around the world are trying to reduce how much they send to landfill. If you can use that food waste to produce something good, a final product, and put something back into grid, it's got to be a good thing. It's a world leader in innovation. We were able to take the technologies that were developed in the UK for food waste digestion and globalise it and bring this into markets all over the world. It's very important to have a long-term relationship with a technology provider. There's been significant improvements over the year. We believe in the process technology that's there, so we come back to the same supplier. Our relationship with Enrich4 has grown over the last five years. They have a desire to continue to grow within this business, and they know that from the process design to the technology supply and long-term operation of these plants, we have all of the capabilities to provide complete solutions to our customers.